Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryden Matero and we are here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your benefactor STR inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always, that this method is the add-on method, so everybody knows how to install our add-on method. Make sure you download and install all the requirements that's inside my description below, and make sure that your requirements is the latest version. Once you guys have completed that, then I will leave this mod inside my description below so you guys can download this mod. Once you guys have completed that process, all you guys got to do is go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click and open file location. As you guys can see, I have already installed my requirements, so I don't need to install my requirements. All you guys got to do next is go to your mods folder, go to your update folder, go to time 64, go to your DRC packs folder, and now open up your Benefactory SDR extract folder. Now inside that folder, there is a folder and a text file. Now go and click on the uh, folder that's inside the extract folder, and then drag it inside your DRC packs folder. Open up your readme.txt file and now copy the code that is over here. Copy the DRC pack code and then exit out of your text file, exit out of your extract folder, go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click refresh and then now exit out of your Grand Theft Auto V folder. And then now open up your Open IV folder. Then go to your Grand Theft Auto V windows. This will take about a few seconds. It all depends on your PC performance. Click on Edit Mode. Select Yes. Go to your Mods folder. Go to Update. Go to Update.RPF. Go to Common. Go to Data. Scroll right down the bottom, right click on your DRC list.xml file, and then now go to edit mode. Go to edit, and now scroll right down the bottom, and then all you guys got to do next is where it says item over here, just click on the item right there, press enter once, and then now paste your code right there, guys, and then now save your code. Go back to your drclist.xml and double check to see if your code is there. And yes it is. Exit out of your application, click on edit mode, click on GTA V, then exit out of your open IV, right click, refresh your desktop, and then I'll see you guys in the game. And now we are back as Franklin, so what we're gonna do guys is that we're going to use our trainer V also known as Simple Trainer, and we are going to spawn our vehicle using Simple Trainer. So, all you guys gotta do is press F4, and then now use your num key to go down to Vehicle Spawning. Scroll right down the bottom, and then go to Edit Vehicle Menu, and then into here, you'll see the vehicle right there, guys. So, all I'm gonna do, guys, is that I'm going to press 5 to spawn the vehicle. And there you go guys, right there. This vehicle is so awesome. If you guys need help installing this mod or other mods, then I am more than welcome to help you guys out. There is another mod coming up tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. So with that all said guys, if you guys did like this video, smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace, and I'm out. Don't forget to stay tuned for this video.